What's up, Vanguard World? This is the Brass and Express from Team Absolution here to bring you here to give you another deck profile featuring Wingle Brave. Stick around and find out more. Alright, hey guys, welcome back. Uh, if you're still tuning, this is the deck profile for Thing MLB, uh, Thing Saver Blasters, MLB Thing, whichever you want to call it. Personally, I call it Friendship.deck for reasons. So, obviously, starters want to go brave, nice and powerful. Uh, I'm going to move him off to the side because we'll get more to him later. But he is the starter for the deck. Uh, so, I'm going to start off with grade threes. Uh, got a one of that mile. I'll explain more of him later and why I run that one. The one of MLB. And why do I run one MLB? Because uh, Wingo Brave will get you there. It's just that simple. If you need a grade three that bad, Wingo Brave will get you that great, will get you your grade three, which is MLB. Um, his skill is okay. Um, you really aren't playing him to bank on getting his skill off. That's really not the point, in my opinion. At least, I don't play, when I ride him, I don't play him to go into a skill. I really just play him for the for the blaster name, really. Also, get, also getting a guarantee grade 3 ride is nice. Uh, and finally, we got four thing savers. Uh, Restanding boss card. Not really much more to say about it. Um, he can stand twice. He can stand three times if the board's good enough. You run him because getting the soul form doesn't. It's not hard. It doesn't clash. Doesn't clump. It's nice and simple. <clears throat> Why only six grade threes? Because as I said before, Wingo Brave will get you a great. Can almost always guarantee you a grade three ride. So you really don't need much more than your thing savers, your one MLB, and your tech choice. So let's get so now that you know the grade threes. Let's actually go into the extra deck right quick. So then I can talk more about At Mile. Uh, so got a one of Gablade for when things are real bad. Got the two At Miles. At Mile really good on the GB2. Can search any grade two I need. Also At Mile over At Mile is not bad at all in any sense of the word. Got two of Saint Blow. Got. Two religious for when I'm on MLB, which is nice, or MLB or Think Saver. Whether I get the crit or not is really just an extra bonus that powers where it's at. And I got the one of, the one of, what's this meant? The one of Samuel, because to quote, quote my Virginian buddies, you never underestimate the outplay. I... Pers now, I've seen lists run Madu. You can do that. There's nothing wrong with running Madu. Um, but I like having this card just as an option, just as my option to use if I can. Have I used this skill yet? No. But being in a situation where I can just pop him for a damage is always nice. So, that's, that's, that is that. So that is my extra deck. Using my grade threes, nice and powerful. All right, let's get into let's get into the grade two game right here. <clears throat> All right, so we got the one of Blaster Blade Spirit, the one of Blaster Dark, the three Blaster Blade Seekers. Let's see, slide these slide these down real quick. Hey, there we go. The three Blaster Blade Seekers for Things Saver, and also because he has Blaster in his name. <laughs> The four Lou the God. And last but definitely not least, with best artwork on top, the four blaster blade. MVP. Alright, so let's dive into this for a little bit. Yeah. One of Blaster Blade Spirit. Uh one is a blaster, two 10k base, which is really nice if you just happen to have him in hand a ride on your grade two. Really strong to be on. Uh, did I mention he's a blaster? I think I said he was a blaster. He's a blaster. So I can get him with Lou. And if I get him with Lou, or even 
get them with Lou or at Mile. If it comes down to it, I can CB1 to Papa G with Blaster Blade Spirit Skill, which is also nice. <clears throat> uh, Blast Dark, one of because I can ground with Lou if I really need it, and one of just to get where's Homeboy at? Just to get MLB skill off if I can, and it's necessary. If I basically if I have no other plays, then I can get MLB off, get MLB skill off. Uh, three. Blaster Blade Seekers, obviously for the Thing Saver and the fact that it's a blaster. Woo! Nice and nice and blaster. Uh, for Lou, Lou is just an awesome card. One, he goes into the Soul, which is great for Thing Saver. Two, he searches out any of my. Let's see, is it is it any just Grade Two? Yeah, Grade Two Cover Blaster. So that's I have target. I literally have targets for days. Three, he helps with the rush, the great two game. It's this card's pretty insane. He does so much for so little, so much for so little. Uh, Blaster Blade the MVP. Uh, why is Blaster Blade the MVP? Uh, because reasons. We'll we'll get into that later when we get <clears throat> soon farther down the card pool. But uh, thanks to Lou, this card. Thanks to Lou and other cards, this guy is just. A monster. Just a monster. Uh, so I don't think that's all I really want to say about these <clears throat> guys for right now. Uh, oh, actually, um, just going back to the whole Wingle Brave train right here. While he's obviously in this deck. Um, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine blasters. So there, <laughs> there you got nine grade twos. Nine grade twos to hopefully ride. For Wingle Brave skill. Uh, Blue's not a blaster, which is sad. Hopefully you don't ride him. It can happen though. It's just it's just one of those things. But other than that, more often than not, you will ride a blaster and you will be a-okay. So then you can search out your MLB, or if MLB's already in your hand, search out another blaster. There's no reason not to. So that's that that is that's boom, boom. Boom. Alright, so let's let's hop over to the grade ones right quick. Alright, so we got one, two, Blaster Laura, just for Blaster and his name for Doggy Brave over here. Uh, one, two, three, four. We got four Barkle. Four Barkle to enable good old Lou. And uh, to help Blaster Blade with some unflip if you're on Blaster Vanguard, which actually is a lot easier than it sounds in this deck. <laughs> but yeah, again, that unflip is really nice because it lets you abuse more of your skills, such as Thing Saver, your At Mile skills, any of your Stride skills, or any of your Blaster skills. And let me tell you, I've used all of these Blaster skills. <laughs> You would think, like, oh, yeah, you know, but don't you need it for things? Either? I mean, no, not not necessarily, but I've used, except for Blaster Dark, because I never, <laughs> that, there we go, I lied, I haven't used Blaster Dark skill, but I've used Spirits, I've used Seekers, and I've used Blaster Blades, and uh, Barkle helps with all that, based, unflipped is based. Uh, so, yeah, for Lou, I mean, I'm sorry, for Barkle to enable Lou and your Blaster Blades, uh, well, the rest of my great ones. Woo! Uh, four stride, fu four stride fire, because you only run six grade threes, and making it easier for yourself to stride is nice. And four unflip PGs because it helps with thing saver and all your other skills. But really, thing saver. <clears throat> so yeah, that's uh, that's it for the grade. That's it for the grade one. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Blasters for Barkle if you get first swing, which is nice. Also, having all these Blaster 1s and 2s helps with religious skill, so you don't have to get MLB off if you want that extra crit right off the bat. Alright, so uh, that is that is that. Oh no, I'm dropping stuff. That ain't good. Alright, so we got the 1s. Let me scoop all this right up. I'm gonna go brave. I'm gonna stay right here. 
Alright, and then uh, let's get down the triggers real quick. Uh, four heel, it's pretty standard. Uh, four bar, I'm sorry, four margal. Because um, draw and drawing into dudes is always nice. Plus, if an emergency, I need the soul for soul saver. Instant access to soul if it's in my hand. Uh, then we got eight crit, four of which being just opponent as of right now, and the other four being based flogel, based god, flogel, based of based flogel dog, poodle dog thing. Um, this crit is pretty disgusting. One, let's, uh, let's get all these triggers out of the way real quick and talk about this dog. This dog is, in my opinion, MVP of just this deck. <laughs> let's, let's just talk about this crit real quick. <clears throat> mm -mm, let's get the mess out of the way. So, Flogel. Uh, Flogel, for one. It's also another card that enables Lou. So, with Flogel and Barco, you have eight targets that can enable Lou. But also it turns good old Blaster Blade into Title Soul. So, that's uh, pretty disgusting. And after it restands the Blaster Blade that's one of their Vanguard, it shuffles back into the deck. So, it's a crit, it's a trigger, that's a crit. It goes back into the deck to re to restand a, a, a unit and a deck that has the potential to just naturally boost their units on steroids. That's kind of that 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 that's, that's dumb. I've killed so many people with Flogel and, Bla and Blaster Blade, like. Not even like the rest of these boss cards. Not even the rest of the boss cards. Not a, I have killed more people with Flogo and Blaster Blade than with Thing Saver or MLB or Strides. And I'm not just talking about because I checked Flogo as a crit. Because I did that too. No, th 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 this, is, this is obnoxious <laughs> on a completely different level. So yeah, that, that is... That's, I think it's a little bit everything, so I'm going to just take this next few seconds to talk about this, this, this deck in a little bit more detail, because it plays, it's just, it's kind of hard to explain, like, you know, we call the deck Thing MLB, or whatever you want to call it, but it's kind of like one big toolbox, yeah, you, I'm going to use that word a lot here, but, like, you have the Lou with the Flogel, Let's see, or the Barkle, to search out any of your blasters for any situation that you need them for. Oh wait, let me flip, let me flip this over so you guys can see what I'm doing over here. Sorry guys. Woohoo. So you got, like I said, to search out any blaster that you need for whatever situation you're in. Uh, no matter what grade 3 boss you're on, you're, you're, you're gonna, you're, you're gonna be fine. If you're on MLB, you've either got MLB skill off, or you have access to religious as one of your first strides, which is disgusting. Uh, if you're on MLB, you have easier access to your unflip with Barkle. Uh, of course, you have access to Think Saver as well for religious and Barkle, but you have the Legion first, which may not be an option at that point, and which may not be an early option at whatever particular point of the game you're at. Uh, Atmile is great sent for the sole fact that if I stride over him and use his stride skill, I can just call dudes and make make them big just cause, which is nice. Um, so I can just go stride, call Blaster Blade, or, or Barkle, or Lou and Barkle, or Flogel and Blaster Blade, or Flogel and Lou, and then just, you know, start teeing off any triggers I can put on a spare blaster blade that I called with the Lou that so swing swing Lou have a 12k blaster blade any triggers can go on him and I can swing with this twice it's it's, pr it's pretty silly pretty silly 
Uh, so let's see, like, <clears throat> Lou is always going to be live no matter what boss you're on, which is great. Uh, if I'm on Thing Saver, Blaster Blade Seeker is live, which is cool. If I'm on, yeah, I already talked about if I'm on an MLB, that's live. Uh, just, you have so many options. If I ride any of my Grade 2 Blasters, and if I have spare Blasters in hand, as long as I have a Barkle, I can keep abusing skills, because I'll keep unflipping. Like, I can't tell you the amount of times I've gone, okay, uh, Ride Blaster Blade, <laughs> Ride Blaster Blade Seeker, uh, call, call Lou, and then had a, basically a free attack. Basically an extra free attack, because I called the Blaster Blade and got the unflip and a 12, an extra 12k swing. Let me see, one time, let me see, it went, ah. Once again, it's upside down for you guys. I am. Oh, actually, no, it's right side up. I'm just stupid. Let's see. There was there are times you can just go uh, ride blast blade seeker. Uh, blah, blah, blah. where you go? Call another blade. Call another blast blade seeker to kill a dude. Just cause, cause now you have the seeker name too. But also you're on a blaster, so if, if you know you do, so you can call that there. Then call a blaster blade for and unflip. Just cause, like you. You fit so many requirements, it's pretty obnoxious. It's also kind of cool, actually. And, you know, called Flowable, and then you just start teeing off on them. It, this deck is... I This deck is a toolbox. They're just plays. They're, they're just plays. No matter what you're on, no matter what your grade 3 you're on, you have options. And I think kind of, that's kind of like what I like playing. This deck so much. You sit, like, I'm always, like, every game I'm always just like, oh, hey, I just found a new play I can do. Like, it's, this deck is really fun. It's really, really good. Um, um, is that, is a Century Guard, is the Century Guard version better? Probably. Probably. Most likely. However, this deck, in my opinion, is probably gonna have a better is probably gonna have a better link joker matchup just because we have access to Think Saver. Should probably go play test that so I can actually, you know, back up my words, but like I said, probably. And it can still beat the things that Saint Guard beats, so there there you go. This is uh this is a MLB thing, blaster friendship, whatever. <laughs> Whatever you want to call it, this is uh, this is toolbox dot deck right here. This has been the Braxton Express. This is uh, been another Team Up Solution deck profile. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. If you have any questions for this or any tech comments you want to mention to me, just put them in the comments, and I'll be sure to check them out and uh, get back to you guys as soon as I can. All right, uh, toolbox. Okay, thanks. Bye, guys. Later.